appreciate your help. I'm afraid those bags did their damage already. <coughs> if you were trying to reach the freight yards in hope of escaping, then just forget about it. The military is rounding up everyone and everything they can find, and either killing them or bringing them up here for questioning. A colleague and I came up with our own plan for escape, and we were on our way to one of the old prototype labs when we ran into them. But listen to me. If you still want to get out of here alive, your only hope may be to find my friend. <coughs> if you can get past the soldiers, find Dr. Rosenberg. With him, you may have a chance to get out of this place. No, I'm afraid I'm not Dr. Rosenberg. Anyone hear me?
Can anyone hear me? Hello? Can anyone hear me? I'm afraid I'm not Dr. Rosenberg, but you'll still help me, won't you? Let's go.
Can anyone hear me? Hello? I'm in here. Can anyone hear me? Yes, I'm Dr. Rosenberg. Although I'm not very proud to admit it, seen as though I'm partially responsible for all of this. How did you know my name? Oh, I see. Poor Harold. Yes, our plan was to get to one of the old prototype labs. It involved something that very few people in the facility are authorized to know about. The same technology that brought about this catastrophe could also be our only way out. You see, I was involved in the very early work on teleporter technology, long before the Lambda Complex was even built. There may be enough equipment in the old lab to piece together a device that would allow us to teleport outside of the facility. As improbable as that may sound to someone like yourself. Of course, none of that does a whole lot of good while we're stuck in here. Hmm. Perhaps I could help boost you through that vent in the ceiling. If you're lucky, you might be able to take those soldiers by surprise. Let's try this. need to head back to the area where you met Harold. The access to the old lab should still be there, but we may have to break through some of the newer construction to get to it. All right, let's stick together. Now there's no time to waste. Lead the way, Calhoun. Lead the way, Calhoun.
Let's stick together. We're almost there. All right. Let's hope we don't run into any more of those soldiers. Yes, here it is. We'll need to break through this to get to the elevator. We should have chosen the Lambda reactor for an escape, but the crew there is bent on fighting the creatures, with all their hopes set on someone named Freeman. Let those fools try and fight a battle they can't win. I just want to get out of here. You won't even know I'm here. Well, I hope the old security system is still active. With any luck, my fingerprint ID is still valid and on file. Dr. Rosenberg, thank God you made it. We've managed to piece together some of the larger equipment, but you'll need to oversee the rest of the construction. Excellent, Walter. Finish aligning the power cell matrix, and I'll see if I can get the system online in the main room. Now there's no time to waste. The equipment is in better shape than I expected. Unfortunately, this older technology does not have the ability to target an Earth destination in its current state. You see, Mr. Calhoun, teleportation isn't as easy as going from point A to point B. We've discovered a strange border world that was somehow involved in the process, which kept us from accurately predicting where any given teleportation event would lead to back on Earth. Some of the more promising research on the matter led to a device that could be attached to the strange crystalline structures we found on this border world. Now, this device could then be used as a focal point and a relay to aid in the teleportation. Well, in theory, that is. We lost contact with the survey group shortly after the device was in place. We later discovered other methods of aiming the field, but all of the equipment in this lab uses the older technology. In order for any of us to get out of here alive, someone will have to go to the border world and activate the device. I'm afraid you're the only one who can do this, seeing as how everyone else will be needed to operate the equipment. We should be able to get you fairly close to where the survey team had set up, but I fear the likelihood of running into alien creatures is very high. Once you find the device, simply power it on and align the emitters until the signal reaches maximum strength. We'll reopen the teleporter for your return once we receive the signal, but you must hurry back, as we can only keep it open for a short amount of time. All right, I'm going to initiate the teleporter charging sequence now. Be ready, Mr. Calhoun. Once the field is open, it will become unstable very quickly. Simmons, can you hear me? It's ready.
primary capacitors have reached full charge. Simmons, release the damping locks and open the field. Enter the teleporter! 